So um, the application that I would recommend is this one right here called Zodo. Um, let's, see, let's get rid of this. So Zodo is my favorite PDF editing and not editing, but PDF viewing application, strictly viewing. Um, it feels a lot more like somebody actually realized that people are using PDF viewers on tablets and Chromebooks and said, well, let's make a more desktop and tablet kind of hybrid uh, UI and experience for it. Whereas Adobe is like, well, let's just give you a reason to charge you 10 bucks a month for a license. So here um, you can turn on single page viewing. So say for example, I'm swiping through my Metroid theory textbook right now and you can see every page individually kind of like you wanted to. Um, so yeah, I think that might work for you. Then in addition, when you do, say you do need to highlight something without opening up any menus or anything, you can simply put your pen to the screen and you can circle it and you can point there, you can change the colors on this. It's just, it just works. Um, yeah, so you can't, it, the pen writing and stuff is not as robust as say Squid is. But you can still, if you just need to point to something um, and just kind of say, hey, yeah, we'll focus here, focus on this representable matroids, um, you can easily write on the screen, do problems or write something to explain it in more detail. It's really, really, it's really awesome. Um, and so it works like this in Chrome and excuse me, in laptop mode and tablet mode. So. I have a Pixel Slate. I'm in laptop mode now. I just transitioned to tablet mode uh, by turning off my keyboard. And so it's the same, just, yeah, this is great. It's way better than Adobe. And like I said, being able to have multiple um, pages open. So like I have my notes from when I took my Metroid theory class here so I can bounce back between this and that. And these I took in Squid and I just put them over here because sometimes I want to have it open more than one place, but yeah. So that's, this is by far the application I would recommend. Do not look into Adobe. Uh, well, I mean, look into it, go to Adobe, test it out, and then try Zoto and see that all the features, every single one, it's included for free in the application. I emailed the developers and was like, well, you guys have a way better application than Adobe. Is there any way that I can send you guys some money or is there like a pro version or anything to pay for this really just awesome, hands down, best PDF editor? Um, is there any way I can pay for this app? And they said, no, um, you can just tell your friends about it, but we made the Android version free and we wanna keep it that way. I'm like, wow, that is, that's so awesome. So yeah, um, this is definitely, the application and the developers that I would recommend, whereas Adobe, it's like, yeah, it'll be $10 to write on the screen. So, yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, now I got to end my recording. <laughs>